Thank you for reading scripture with me today. I'm going to be reading Psalm 67 and Psalm 68. Psalm 67, verse 1. May God be gracious to us and bless us, and make his face to shine upon us, that your way may be known on earth, your saving power among the nations. Let the peoples praise you, O God. Let all the peoples praise you. Let the nations be glad and sing for joy. For you judge the peoples with equity and guide the nations upon earth. Let the peoples praise you, O God. Let all the peoples praise you. For the earth has yielded its increase. God, our God, shall bless us. God shall bless us. Let all the ends of the earth fear him. Psalm 68, verse 1. God shall arise. His enemies shall be scattered. And those who hate him shall flee before him. As smoke is driven away, so you shall drive them away. As wax melts before fire, so the wicked shall perish before the Lord. But the righteous shall be glad. They shall exalt before God. They shall be jubilant with joy. Sing to God. Sing praises to his name. Lift up a song to him who rides through the deserts. His name is the Lord. Exult before him. Father of the fatherless and protector of widows is God in his holy habitation. God settles the solitary in a home. He leads out the prisoners to prosperity, but the rebellious dwell in a parched land. Psalm 68, verse 7. O God, when you went out before your people, when you marched through the wilderness, the earth quaked, the heavens poured down rain. Before God, the one of Sinai, before God, the God of Israel, rain in abundance, O God, you shed abroad. You restored your inheritance as it languished. Your flock found a dwelling in it. In your goodness, O God, you pr provided for the needy. The Lord gives the word. The women who announce the news are a great host. The kings of the armies, they flee, they flee. The women at home divide the spoil. Though you men lie among the sheepholds, the wings of a dove covered with silver, its pinions with shimmering gold, when the Almighty scatters kings there, let snow fall on Salmon. O mountain of God, mountain of Bashan, O many peaked mountain, mountain of Bashan, why do you look with hatred, O many peaked mountain, at the mount that God desired for his abode, yes, where the Lord will dwell forever? Psalm 68, verse 17. The chariots of God are twice ten thousand, thousands upon thousands. The Lord is among them. Sinai is now in the sanctuary. You ascended on high leading a host of captives in your train and receiving gifts among men, even among the rebellious, that the Lord God may dwell there. Blessed be the Lord, who daily bears us up. God is our salvation. Our God is a God of salvation, and to God the Lord belong deliverances from death. But God will strike the heads of his enemies, the hairy crown of him who walks in his guilty ways. The Lord said, I will bring them back from Bashan, will bring them back from the depths of the sea, that you may strike your feet in their blood, that the tongues of your dogs may have their portion from the foe. Your procession is seen, O God, the procession of my God, my King, into the sanctuary. Psalm 68, verse 25. The singers in front, the musicians last, between them virgins playing tambourines. Bless God and the great congregation, the Lord, O you who are of Israel's fountain, there is Benjamin, the least of them, in the lead, the princes of Judah in their throng, the princes of Zebulun, the princes of Naphtali. Zum summon your power, O God, the power, O God, by which you have worked for us. Because of your temple at Jerusalem, kings shall bear gifts. Rebuke the beasts that dwell among the reeds, the herd of bulls with the calves of the peoples. Trample underfoot those who lust after tribute. Scatter the peoples who delight in war. Nobles shall come from Egypt. Cush shall hasten to stretch out her hands to God. O kingdoms of earth, sing to God. Sing praises to the Lord. To him who rides in the heavens, the ancient heavens. Behold, he sends out his voice, his mighty voice. Psalm 68, verse 34. Ascribe power to God, whose majesty is over Israel and whose power is in the skies. Awesome is God from his sanctuary, the God of Israel. He is the one who gives power and strength to his people. Blessed 
be God. This is God's word. May the Lord be with you today.